Siemens Ford Payne is a 200,000 square foot manufacturing facility. We're located in Northeast Alabama, and we are the America's region center for electrical components for Siemens Energy. We mainly have two different types of business. We have the new apparatus business, uh, which um, we manufacture parts and components for new generators that are manufactured and assembled in our facility in Charlotte, North Carolina. And we also have a huge portion of our service business here in, in Fort Payne, where we manufacture components for service that go directly to the field. Siemens Energy components from this facility, they're shipped all over the world. We basically are divided into five COCs. The first COC is rotor coils. They're going to take straight copper, they're going to mill vent slots in it. They'll then form it so it's ready to go in the rotor and then ship it on to the Charlotte to be wound into a rotor. Our second COC is insulation components. They're making insulation components for large rotors and stators. And there you'll see a lot of milling machines. You'll see a lot of specialized cutting machines that looks very simple, but each of those parts is specifically designed for a purpose. Next, in the parallel ring area, this is where you'll take copper and insulation parts that are custom designed to go around the end of the generator. In this area, you'll see a lot of customized bending of copper and a lot of customized work as most parallel ring systems on generators are customly designed to the application. Our other two areas are stator coils, which are divided into hard and soft coils. We start with just a raw piece of copper and we pull that into form a stator coil. This machine, as an example, that's behind me, is used for forming stator coils. What they do is they take a straight stator coil and they'll actually make all the bends and, and actually assume the shape of the coil in the generator. And the last thing is the VPI process. That's where we impregnate the coils with resin and harden the insulation system that's on them. Since 2009, Siemens has invested over 12 million US dollars in this facility. With the automation equipment we bought, we are actually very cost competitive here in, in the US, in Alabama, with a very highly skilled workforce.